Good evening. Hi. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. How are you? Good evening. Isaac says good evening on the chat. <laughs> okay, good evening from Andrea. Nice. Good evening, everyone. How are you? What day is today? How is it going? It's going great. Yes. All right. Is everybody connected? Well, we have to wait for some people. Let's wait for some minutes. Just two or three minutes until everybody is logged in. How was your weekend? Did you have a good weekend? Yes. Relax also, weekend. A relax <laughs> weekend. Okay. Yes. Great. I'm glad. I'm glad you rested. That's nice. It's necessary. It is. It is very necessary. Right. Yes. Okay. And today is Monday. Monday. Exactly. Monday, August. Fifteen. Fifteenth, exactly. August fifteenth. Or the fifteenth of August. All yes. right. Yes. Let's see how many people reported. <clears throat> On Teacher, the chat, yes, sir. I I I watch uh, the TV in only English yesterday. Good job, perfect. That's an excellent idea. Yes, or the I movies. Understand. Yes. yes, I understand and 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 you practice. You practice the listening. You practice vocabulary, pronunciation, pronunciation exactly. That's great. That's a good way of practicing movies also in English. Yes. If you want to probably watch movies that are easy to understand, watch animated. <clears throat> and when you watch the movie, you also play the subtitles in English. So you're listening and you're reading in English. Oh. That's another good idea. Only, yes. only listen. Only uh -huh. listen. Yes. yes, that's one that's one idea. But another idea, yes. if you want to read also, you can play the subtitles, but in English. Yes. And you practice, practice. two skills. <laughs> you practice <laughs> listening and you practice reading. Uh-huh. Nice. So I see Isaac, Andrea, Edith, Diana, Andrea says, yes, everything is okay. Jocelyn, Andrea, relax, we can listen to music and <laughs> I learn new words. That's right. Yes, true, 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 true. Excellent. And you improve definitely the pronunciation. That's the main point. That's a great idea. Okay, so I hope everybody had a wonderful weekend. Everybody enjoyed. Everybody rested. Everybody spend time with family everybody who was at home ate something good okay <laughs> yes okay because last week um we missed one day because of the storm right we're going to uh cover that class today that was on tuesday so five lessons per week this is the number five of the second week um, and today we round up, we finished um, the unit two, right? And of course, the symbol present for daily routines. This is the topic we've been talking about a lot. I bet you already know a lot of expressions, a lot of verbs, a lot of vocabulary, 
how to express about your daily activities, your daily routines, those habits that are your habits, your activities that you must re repeat, right? So at the end, yes, of this video conference, participants must be able to identify and use present statements with routines. Uh, of course, in order to do that, we're going to review, review means repasar, right? So we're going to review the use of the third person singular for he, she, it. We're going to review affirmative and negative statements. We're going to review the use of don't and doesn't. We're going to review as well uh, asking yes, no questions with do or does, okay? So that's basically what we're going to do. And in the meantime, let's have the attendance. I hope everybody is fine, everybody's connected, and everybody was able to connect tonight. I don't see Alice. Alicia, have you seen Alicia? No, right? No, she's not here. Oh no, what's happening to Alicia? Okay, Ana Maria Marcela. Ella me dijo que se iba a conectar un poquito tarde porque le tocó ir a ver a un paciente de emergencia. Oh, my goodness. Thank you for letting us know. Okay. Andrea. Present. Okay. Blanca. Present. Diana. Present, Miss. Edgar. Present. Edith. Edith, Edith, hi. Fernando. Teacher, Fernando me dice que había tenido problemas con el vehículo subiendo los chorros. Oh, my goodness, poor ah, Fernando. Así que se iba a conectar un poquito más tarde, tal vez como a las nueve, porque okay. se quedaron, se calentó ah. el vehículo. Ay, no, poor, <laughs> poor child, but thank you for letting me know. Okay. okay. Oh, no. Gabriela. Gabriela no se volvió a conectar, ¿verdad? Gabriela, oh, Gabriela, she's here, pero no la escucho. Gabi, Gabi, Gabi. En el chat, probably. She's on the, on the traffic. Ok. Oh, no. I don't listen and she doesn't say anything. All right, Glenda, Margarita. Present, Miss. Hi, Hans. Present, Miss. Hi, Isaac. Hello, present. Hi. <laughs> Jose Daniel. Hasn't come yet. Hasn't arrived. Hasn't connected yet. All right, Jocelyn. Present. Juan Miguel. No, Juan Miguel today? No. Oh no, that's sad. That is so sad. <laughs> okay, so Manuel, Alberto. Present. Hi. Oscar René. Present, Miss. Hi, Rodrigo. Rodrigo, Rodrigo. I see Rodrigo's children. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hola. Hello. <laughs> Hola. Hi. Thank you. <laughs> Raul. Hi. And Sandra. Present. Hi. All right. So this is the attendance for tonight. Thank you, everybody, for joining. Hopefully. We're doing great, we're fine. We are taking advantage of this time. How about the platform? Finish the unit two? Yes? Great. No excuses. <laughs> we need to complete it, okay? Tonight, the latest, I'm going to have to get the grades for the unit two, okay? So the section two. All right. So as I was mentioning in this class, we're going to review definitely the use of the simple present statements with routines. Okay. 
I know we do different activities, we work, we move to work, we have different obligations, responsibilities at work. But what about the weekend? What do you usually do on the weekend? Uh huh. I listen to music, I go out with friends, I stay with my family, I go to the beach, <laughs> I play game with my children, I watch movies, I watch TV in English, okay, I read books. What do you usually do on the weekend? Because we just finished a weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Well, sometimes, yeah, we have to work on Saturday, but what about Sunday? Or you say, oh, on Sundays or on the weekend, I go to the church, I go to the supermarket, I play an instrument. What are those activities different that you do over the weekend that you don't do on usually? Usually means on daily basis from Monday to Friday. Piensen en por lo menos tres actividades que hacen diferente el weekend de aquellas que usualmente hacen durante toda la semana. Okay? Like, I go to the supermarket because on the week I don't have time to go to the supermarket. I clean the house and I do the laundry. Those are three things that I never do during the week. I have to wait until the weekend to do them, right? So think about three activities that at least I mean, at least three activities that you do over the weekend that you don't do on the weekdays. Okay, pensemos. Think about three activities. Si necesitan escribirlas, está bien, no problem. So you say, okay, three activities that I do on the weekend that I don't do on the weekdays, that I don't do from Monday to Friday. Okay? Yes? Got him? Thumbs up? <laughs> Uh -huh. I wash my dog, I wash my car, <laughs> I, I play ping pong, by three activities que si las hacen, ya, ya las tienen, yes, bye, ahora piensen en three activities que no las hacen, pero que ustedes si se diera la oportunidad las harían, por ejemplo, I go dancing, I go swimming, I paint. <laughs> I sing in a karaoke. I play soccer. I do yoga. Esas three activities tienen que ser falsas, pero que sí le gustaría hacerlas. ¿Ya? Yeah. Three que sí son reales y three que se las inventan. In you imagine, pero como que si las hicieran, yeah. I go fishing, I fly <laughs> on a plane, of course. <laughs> okay, I go to the botanical garden. <laughs> ya tiene las tres reales y las tres falsas. Yes, true and false. Bye. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I go on an airplane. <laughs> I don't go on an airplane. I never fly on an airplane. Hmm, that's sad. I know. <laughs> okay. Bye. Ahora voy a seleccionar a alguien y esa persona nos va a tener que decir una de esas actividades, ya sea true or false. Y los demás vamos a adivinar si eso que esa persona dice que hace es true or false. ¿Bien? Esa persona tiene que, que verse bien convincente. Very convincing. Yes. For example, si yo les digo on the weekend, let me see. On the weekend, I visit children in the Bloom Hospital. True or false?
True. Y los demás que creen. On True. the weekend, I visit children at the little hospital. True. True, true, true. Y los demás, qué mentirosa la teacher. False. Digan, pues, no, no se lo meten viendo con cara de false. Ajá. <laughs> uh -huh. On the weekend, I visit children at the Bloom Hospital. True or false? No, ya tengo varios que sí confían en mí. True. And the rest? False. 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 Solo tengo one false versus three true. Mm -hmm. Jeffer? True. Isaac says true. True. No, ya ven, fui convincente, but it's false. Pero sí me gustaría hacerlo. If I have time, I would like to do it. Okay? Pero no lo hago. <laughs> ok. Bye. Es el turno así de convincente. Pero todos tienen que participar y decir true or false. Yes? Bye. Veamos. The first person to participate would be Andrea. Uh -huh. um, on the weekend, I go to the mountain. Uh -huh. True or false? False. Por qué no creen que Andrea es fitness? True. It's true. 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 Is fit? Yes. True. She, she, she going to the Isalco volcano. Ah, ya ven lo que ya hablaron con ella, ya saben que hace on the weekend. Ajá. Uh -huh. True or false? Revelenos. Para los que no confiaron en usted. False. False. <laughs> Ya he ido, pero no lo hago siempre. <laughs> All right, bye. Le creímos. I thought you got mountains every weekend. <laughs> yeah. Okay, next person, Blanca. So, microphone is, yes, go ahead. In the weekend, I um, go to swimming. swimming. I go swimming. In the, the ocean. In the ocean. True or false? False. <laughs> <laughs> no doubt. Everybody says false. False? I can say true? False? False. ¿Por qué creen que es false? Why do you think it is false? Eh, this kind. Of this the kind, biggest smile. No, <laughs> no boring. Yes. Because okay, okay, she was looking up and thinking about what she was going to say, right? The biggest smile. All right. Blanca is true or false? Do you go swimming in the ocean? False. False. <laughs> All right. Nice. Okay, let's see. Diana. Okay. On the weekend, I go to the kitchen. She has stay at the kitchen cooking. True or false? True. True. False. False. <laughs> Okay, true. And the truth is true, true, true. Como dos false. False. You hate the kitchen. <laughs> Delivery <laughs> on the weekend. Okay. All right. Edgar, your turn. Mm -hmm. 
Or hi, Edgar. Because I know he's Edgar. Yeah. Tell us. Yes, mm -hmm. yeah, in the <clears throat> in the weekend I watch my motorcycle. Motorcycle on the weekend I watch the motor my motorcycle. Yes. True. 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 Alguien dijo false. No. Everybody says true. Okay, Fernando false. says false. False. <laughs> uh, okay, Renee says false. All right, Edgar. False. Right. It's, it's true. It's true. It's true. He washes his motorcycle on the weekend. All right. Edith. Hi. Hi. Yeah, I, I play soccer. On the weekend, I play soccer. False. <laughs> false. It's false. My fellow false. Manila. False. <laughs> you never play soccer. No. No, you, false. <laughs> yes, you wish you have time to play soccer on the weekend, right? <laughs> okay, nice. Let's see, Fernando. Fernando, you have to say a sentence about the weekend, something that you say that you do, but we're gonna guess if it is true or false. Um, okay. Um, on the weekend, I uh, visit my family. I visit my family. That's true. True? True. False. 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 <laughs> uh, Fernando, reveal. Is false. It's false because you live with your family. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nice. Let's see. Gabriela. Le siento se apagó, Miss. Ah. Le sorry, se apagó la cámara, pero acabo de llegar porque no tuvimos problem. un percance. Yes. Ah, uh, Rene told me. All right, Gabriela, are you here? Gabriela, Gabriela. No, apparently Gabriela cannot participate. Hands. Perdón, mi estaba comiendo algo. Mi. No problem, no problem. Don't worry. So we're gonna go with the next person. Uh, we go with Isaac. No, 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 no. Puedo, puedo participar. No All problema. right, go ahead. No, no, no. Le vamos a ver la cara si no está mintiendo. No, 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 no. No es mentira, estoy cerrando la pregunta. No, de lo que nos está diciendo, si es true okay, or false. Okay. No, de eso yo le creo. <laughs> on the weekend, on the weekend, I go to the church. False. 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 It's false. No nos mintió. False. True or false. Es false. Ah, yo pensé que iba a decir, aunque no lo crean, es true. Aunque no parezca. Ay, no. Bye, Ergens. Thank you. Isaac. On weekends, I practice yoga. True. False. True. True. False. It's true. 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 Uh, false. Isaac? It's false. Ah. <laughs> yo también tenía la esperanza que, que practicara yo. <laughs> Teacher, Just... vaya me anotando, vaya me anotando que yo voy adivinando casi todas. It's true. <laughs> exactly. Punto, compañero. <laughs> sí les ha prestado atención a sus partners, no como ah. <laughs> Permítame, solo voy a conectar que se está descargando mi compu. Just one minute. 
wait a second. But the next person is going to be Jocelyn. Si quiere, díganme, Jocelyn. I listen. Mm, okay. On the weekends, I do tourism in my country. Mm, I do tourism in my country. I say turismo en su país. True or false? True. Good point. Mm -hmm. True or false? True. 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 Uh huh. Revelanos la verdad, yo soy. True or false? False. <laughs> I stay in my bed. All right. One second. Okay. Here I am. Okay, so it was false. Jocelyn doesn't do tourism in her country. Manuel. Mm -hmm. um, on the weekend, I compete in motorcycle racing. False. It's false. True. Uh -huh. True. Casi la convenza. <laughs> it's false. It's false. Ah. Pensamos que teníamos otro motorcycle racer. <laughs> okay. And Margarita. <laughs> On the weekend, I went to dinner. You go out for dinner. That means that she goes to a restaurant for dinner. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. True. True. It's true. True. Ah. <laughs> Otra yes. forma de decir, I don't want to cook. <laughs> I go out for dinner. Mm -hmm. Yes, actually, it's so good to go out for dinner on the weekend. All right, the name. In the weekend, I go to the swimming pool. Oh, false. <laughs> <laughs> True. Uh -huh. oh. <laughs> true. <va>? Many. <laughs> <laughs> many true, many ¿Qué, false. ¿Qué más dice true? Mm. Cuatro, tres, no. It's false. It's false. You don't go to the swimming pool. No, I go to the ride mountain bike. Yes, true. All right. Raul. Hi. Hi. On the weekend, I clean the house. Uh -huh. True. True? It's true. True. So true. Mm -hmm. True. True. Three. Really true. No more. No more truth. Okay, Margarita says true on the chat. <laughs> Is it true? Yes. All right. Nice. Honest and Sandra. On the weekend, I bath my dog. She bath. She gives a bath. She gives a shower to the dog. True. 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 False. <laughs> Uh -huh, Sandra. True. 
True. Wow. Nice. You have a dog. And you wash your dog on the weekend. All right. I think that's everybody, right? Okay. I don't know if Miguel is just connecting. All right. Great. Okay, so now what do you remember from your partners? ¿Qué recuerdan de las acciones que dicen sus partners? Uh -huh. Ride the motorcycle. Okay, Rene rides a motorcycle on the weekend. True. Mm -hmm. What else? Mm -hmm. Go out for a dinner. Margarita goes out for dinner on the weekend. <laughs> uh -huh. What about Isaac? ¿Qué recuerdan de Isaac? Uh, practice yoga. Yoga. Don't practice. He does. doesn't practice yoga. He doesn't practice yoga. Lo engañó. <laughs> what about Andrea? Doesn't go to the mountain. She doesn't go to the mountain. She doesn't climb a mountain. Uh -huh. What about Blanca? Falls. Swimming. <laughs> she doesn't go swimming in the ocean. Uh -huh. What about Diana? She doesn't cook. She doesn't cook on the weekend. She doesn't spend the weekend on, on, at the kitchen, right? What about Rodrigo? He didn't practice. He didn't participate. He didn't participate. <laughs> Okay, it's true, he didn't participate. All right, what about Hans? Hans doesn't uh, the, go to the church. He doesn't go to the church on the weekend, that's true. Let's see, who else? What about Edward? Mm-hmm. Did you pay attention to Edward? Wash the motorcycle. He washes his motorcycle on the weekend. What about Manuel? Mm -hmm. He doesn't. No sé cómo se dice competir. Compete. Compete in the motorcycle. Yeah, he doesn't compete in motorcycles. All right, nice. Okay, what about Fernando? <laughs> Nobody he, remembers. He uh, doesn't don't uh, visit, don't visit in your family. He doesn't visit his family. Yes. Thank you, partners. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm in your heart and your memory. <laughs> All right. It is memory. ¿Cómo se dice memoria a corto plazo? Short term memory. Ah, short time memory. All right. Sandra, what about Sandra? Mm -hmm. She shower her dog. Yeah, she showers her dog on the weekend. That's right. Okay. Anybody else? What about Manuel? Mm-hmm. Don't remember. Nothing. What about Edith? He doesn't play football. Mm-hmm. She doesn't play soccer. That's right. All right. Good. So you can make sentences, you see, affirmative or negative sentence about a third person. Just by saying what the other person does or doesn't do, of course, all right? So that was part of the practice 
uh, let's continue. Of course, here there are some other activities. Primero, observen bien las images y vean el vocabulary que está abajo. Yes, y hagan sus predictions. ¿Cuál de estas images representa cada una de las activities? Yes. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, do you have them? Yeah. For example, the first picture. Analyst, statist, analyst, statistic. Okay, the first picture. That is about statistics. Uh -huh. Professor. Uh, check proposal. Check proposal. That's right. Okay. All right. So, what about the second picture? What about this one? Analyze studies. Analysis and statistics. So that would be analyze statistics, right? What about this one? Check inventory. check inventory. That would be check, check inventory. inventories. What about this one? Transfer calls. Transfer calls, right? Mm -hmm. Transfer calls. Mm -hmm. Plant a training. Okay, plan a training and organize the receipts. 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 Right. Okay, that's definitely. Yes, check proposal. <clears throat> Analyze statistics, right? Mm -hmm. Check inventory. Transfer calls. Hold on. Okay, so the last one would be, okay, yes, that would be plan training and the last one, organize receipts, right? Okay, here we go. Here we have some other activities, the same thing. Traten de relacionar con cada uno de las actividades que tenemos al lado, las imágenes. ¿Ya? Uh -huh. Audit reports, number one. Uh -huh. Audit reports. That would be number one. Okay. Type emails. Type emails. Take part in a conference. Number three. Take part in a conference. Make phone calls. Make phone calls, right. Arrange an agenda. Arrange an agenda. That's right. Este, ¿Cómo se pronunciaría la número cuatro, teacher? Arrange. Oh, number four? No, la, la, number four. Make phone calls. Number five. Four, make phone calls. And number five, arrange an agenda. Yeah. And the last one? 
Pi or files. Type okay. emails, number two. Uh -huh, number two, type emails, right? And number six, compile files. Yes? Number six, those files in order, verdad? So all the reports, number one, number two, type emails, number three, take part in a conference, number four, make phone calls, number five, would be arrange an agenda, and number six, compile files, all right? Okay, let's continue. <clears throat> okay, use the present simple for general information and routines. I check my emails every morning, he write reports about meeting, she all these inventories, they arrange meeting. Okay, veamos, de estas cuatro cosas, ¿cuáles ustedes hacen? Escriban, ¿cuáles de estas hacen en el chat? For example, si hacen las cuatro, pues I check emails, I write reports about meetings, I audit inventories, I arrange meetings, okay? So you write them all. But if you only do, I check emails, I write reports, solo eso, okay? Sorry. Exactly. I check emails, okay, one. I check email, emails every morning, let's try. Okay, most of you do emails, right? Check emails. Mm -hmm. Every morning, all right. Mm -hmm. Okay, one, two, and four, arrange meetings, right? Write reports, I check emails, I write reports. All right, I check emails in the morning. Mm -hmm. I check emails every morning. All right, good. Oh, okay. I check emails. So the most common is check emails, right? Some people write reports. Nobody arrange meetings. A nadie le toca agendar or organizar reuniones. Okay, write reports. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's great. All right. Good. All right. In the class. Okay, do we have software engineers? Alguien está a cargo de software acá? Nobody? No? Oh, uh, yes, you go to meetings. Uh -huh. Human resource specialist? Alguien que esté en human resource? Nobody? Financial analyst? Maybe me. All right, Jocelyn. We got Jocelyn as financial analyst. All right. Insurance agent? Gente de seguros? No? Okay. Bookkeeper? Bookkeeper is similar to accountant. Anyone? No? ¿Qué significa eso? Accountant, un contador. Y a los registros financieros. And digital marketing manager. Hi. Okay. <laughs> Rodrigo. All right, so we just have like two. Two of these occupations. According to the manual, okay? Es de acuerdo al manual. I know. So, no problems. Okay. Imagine we write, let's see. Let me write the text right here. Financial analyst, let's say, right, Jocelyn. Mm -hmm. Jocelyn is like this. Did I spell your name correctly, Jocelyn? No, it's double S, right? 
and y. Okay. That's right. So what activities do you do as financial analyst? I prepare uh, financial reports. Mm -hmm. She prepares financial reports. Okay, what else? About profits and loss. Okay. Profits and loss. All right. Nice. Eso sería como su main activity, right, at work. Then on this one, we have Rodrigo. Mm -hmm. Rodrigo, what would be like your main function, your main activity as a digital marketing manager? I take uh, a post in Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Mm -hmm. To make posts? Yes. Mm -hmm. On social media. So, so. Mm -hmm. All right. Posts on social media. So that is definitely digital marketing, right? Okay, great. Okay. All right. The others have different occupations. Yes, totally different. So no problem. It's okay. All right. Here we have somebody writing an email. This is, hello Juan, I hope you're excellent. I want to tell you that I'm working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check emails in my office. I organize conferences twice a month. I sometimes train new employees. I check the raw material and I never go out of my office. It's a nice job. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Kind regards, Kevin Velasquez. So what are you going to do with this email? Les voy a compartir la imagen. Ustedes lo van a leer y van a tratar de adaptarlo a su realidad, obviously, ok, si no se lo quieren enviar a Juan, es fine, se lo pueden enviar a cualquiera de la clase, I hope you are excellent, I hope you are fine, pueden cambiar si quieren, I want to tell you, manténganlo igual, I am working in a new company, that I am working in an interesting company, that I am working in a security company, no sé, lo que ustedes quieran decir, some activities I do are the following. Algunas de las actividades que hago son las siguientes. Ahí donde van a desglosar como al menos unas tres o cuatro actividades de las que generalmente hacen. Yes? Y después, it's a nice job. I like my job. I have a nice office. Whatever you want to say. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Es como una forma nice de despedirse, de cerrar. Yes? Ok. ¿Cómo vamos a hacer esto? Of course, pueden tomar nota en su cuaderno, pueden guiarse del ejemplo y pueden apoyarse. Cuando ya lo hayan hecho, se lo leen a su partner. Y su partner se lo va a leer a ustedes también. ¿Es this clear? ¿Está claro lo que vamos a hacer? Yes. Yes. All right, perfecto. Déjenme ver. Creo que vamos a tener algunos grupos de tres, pero la mayoría creo que de dos. Se quedan solo, pues ni modo se van a ir a un grupo de tres. All right, here we go.
ahorita vamos a ver eso. Vaya, ahorita, ahorita. Solo que hoy no, no, sí no puedo compartir porque sí voy. Voy, 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 voy. Ok. Ahí está. Sí, ahí me lo sí. Vaya, ahí empiezo yo si quiere. I, I hope you are excellent. I want to tell, to tell you that I am working in the new company. Sometimes I do our uh, following and check emails. I go. Y ya después lo, lo de. Sí. Ajá. Te voy a escribir y después lo, lo, lo decimos. Igual. Y ahí podemos ir cambiando y digamos cosas que hacemos en el trabajo regularmente. Ajá, ya se me entiende. Digo yo. Ah, también está la compañera ahí. Sí, estamos tres ahorita. <risa> Ajá. O oh, cuando me piden algo que no. no Ay, hace. Miss. Ahí viene la Miss. Miss. What happened? <ríe> Estamos aquí hablando de nuestros sucesos. What happened? De nuestro, traba de nuestro trabajo. Vale, entonces vamos a hacer tres cosas, le entendí, Miss. Uh -huh. De los que hacemos o de los que no hacemos. No, de lo que hacen. De lo que hacen. Sí, primero practiquen el ejemplo. Así lean Primer. nada más. Ajá. Ah. Y luego claro. lo adaptan a su realidad. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Como que se lo estuvieran no. mandando un email a un compañero de la clase. Se puede decir, o sea, entre ustedes, por ejemplo, Fer se lo envía a Diana y Diana se lo envía a Fer. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. okay no es que le deberían enviar un email, ¿verdad? pero como simular. <ríe> si no, ahorita abran su correo. Ajá. ¿Qué significa hope? I hope. Es como Ajá. espero que esté bien. I hope you're excellent. I hope you're fine. Me, uh, andamos medio desconectado. Desconectado sí. del, del <risa> in English. Guay. Y me fue mal en el trabajo ahora. Really. Era ah, terrible mi... thing. Y ya li, ahorita que estamos aquí, Miss, le voy a decir que mañana tengo una reunión y es con el, este, con el, con el de los fundadores de ahí del trabajo y, y no creo saber si me voy a conectar. Really, porque, tan tarde. Porque es a las cuatro y lo, no, lo que pasa es que somos un montón y yo le dije, ahora le, a, mi, a mi jefe, mire, le tengo clase y es como que... Decirle a él que no voy a salir antes de la reunión para ellos es como un pecado. Entonces. Ok, entonces, la meeting is very long. Sí, no, sí, eh, a las cuatro vamos a empezar, supuestamente. En junio, a, ¿a qué hora va a terminar? Ajá, y no sabemos a qué hora es porque somos, yo les estaba contando a Fernando que somos un montón, somos más de 26 los que estamos convocados, más de 26. Wow. Ajá, porque lo que pasa es que como yo estoy recibiendo los reclamos y yo los estoy haciendo pasar, entonces, les tocó. 
Ok. <risa> y entonces, como yo estoy recibiendo los reclamos, me imagino que por eso quieren que yo vaya. No, porque yo no, te, no debería de estar. <risa> ok, no problem. Hopefully no. Ojalá que, que, que sí sea más, más ágil. Pero si no, la vamos a extrañar. Porque no miss you. Miss. Hi. I always check emails in my computer. Mm -hmm. That's possible. I want to talk that I am working. Ok, entonces yo lo leo. Va, lo tengo que leer completo. Dice, I hope you're excellent. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell. Un catéter conectado a, sí. a, la, a las venas. Uh -huh. Wow, está bien eso. Sí, se me hizo raro no ver tu. tu, tu sí, ya, ya salí del, del paciente, así que venía corriendo al carro. A mí, para, para mí, los 15 y los 30 son terribles. Sí, es feo. Eh, Pero... Horrible, horrible. Hay que cerrar las cuentas bien y todo lo demás. Bueno, yo creo que puedo con lo que, con lo que, con lo que, con lo que hiciste. ¿no? Dale, dale. Este, pero no puedo ver el otro nombre de la compañera, solo el tuyo. Ahorita. Ah, Jocelyn. Jocelyn, vale. Sí. Perdón, perdón, porque todavía no se me quedan todos. Pero, hello, Jocelyn en Marcela. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are following. I always check emails in my office. I organize my route, my, my route, and I guide, I, I, I calls, I calls to the, no, sería the, the clients, no sé, clientes. And the clients or the customers, clients. creo que pueden ser, no sé. Ajá, mi, mis clientes, o sea, son más que todo la gente que yo le doy créditos, cosas así. Sí, ya cambia. Pues hay que sacarlas que, a que salgan a la sal. Sí. Uh -huh. Como son dos, pues, <ríe> me imagino. Me imagino. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in the a new company. And sometimes I do argue following. Always check emails in my office. I organize conference with a month. I sometimes try new employees. I check the I like my new I like my new job. It's nice. A pleasure to greet kind regards Andrea Ortiz. Muchas actividades Andrea. Le toca a Manuel. Manuel, Manuel. No, primero le cedemos los honores a Vaya, pues, inicio. Entonces, vamos a dedicárselo a Manuel. Sí, a ver. Sí. Hello, Manuel. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that... I working in a new company. Some activities I don't are the following. I always check emails uh, in in my I in, in my in my in my phone. I organize capacitation once a month. I am looking. 
Bueno, sería entonces... Eh, eh, hello, uh, hello, Isaac and Sandra. Uh, I hope all you are excellent. I wish to... that I am working, I am, I'm uh, working in a new uh, security company. Um, sometimes I do uh, the following. Uh, uh, raise case email in my office, uh, pass a report, um, pass a assistance. I check in the real materials. It's a nice, nice job. I'm looking for more uh, having from from you. Eso sería. ¿Así estaría bien o...? o... Sí, sí. Podríamos repetirlo un par de veces o al menos una vez está bien. Entonces, me tocó ir a hacer el, el inventario. Esa noche, ir a... Entré a las 4 de la tarde del 30 y salí como a las 10 de la mañana del 31. Toda la noche hice el, hice el despacho, hice el inventario y entre otras cosas. Y así todo. No, pero buena pronunciación. Que cuando no sé cómo pronunciar me ayuda. Sí, la verdad que... No, yo tengo una amiga que es, este, es maestra, está traductor, de una misma, eh, uh -huh. bastante en idioma, sino que era más que todo, por ejemplo, las primeras consolas, que me es super NES, eh, full English, o sea, full English, o sea, aprendí, aprendí vocabulario, o incluso por, ya después la... Organizes financial reports para me price accounting accounts in the ERP system in the company. I sing financial statements. Finish to the activities edit. Okay. Eh, al final, Kim's Records, ¿lo, di ¿lo dice usted o lo digo yo? I want to tell you that. No. Ya, lo último, donde dice Kim's Re Records. ¿Quién regas? ¿Quién valer? Bueno, igual. Ok. En la personalidad. Sí, la verdad que sí. Son bien apegadas. Ya me imagino. <risa> Le hice este, eh, con un gusto, eh, 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 espero saber de ti más adelante. Algo así, pues sí, le hago un bloque probar. Ok. 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 Ok
como un hasta pronto o algo así. Ah, pero bastante formal, bastante formal. Ah, que ya así separándolas, digamos que, digamos que tiene un sentido extraño, pero ya la oración completa, forward. Eh, Siento que eso es lo complicado como del inglés, ¿verdad? Porque, o sea, las, a veces hay palabras que solas tal vez tienen un significado y ya que dentro de una oración ya es como que le da otro significado. Irregularmente, pero al menos este, hay como ciertas frases o expresiones que como uno las va escuchando y ya es como que la asocia como... como como, este, como, como si fuesen slangs nuestros, que son con los que hemos crecido y cuando lo decimos, como esta yuca o cosas así, es como que lo entendemos, pero cuando lo separamos, como que, ya, ah, pues, algo así va con el inglés también. Pero bueno. Hoy te toca a ti. Estaba haciendo la, la propia que dijo la mis que, que son ah, tres. Okay. Y ya llevo, ya llevo dos. Solo me falta uno. Miss. Mm -hmm. no. Ay, eh, eh, se dice facturo las ventas. Se dice I invoice the sales. Oh. Mm -hmm. Invoice the sales. Yes. I invoice the sales. Mm -hmm. Eso sí, sí, self sí significa futuras. Ventas. Ventas. Ah. Mm -hmm. Ándale. Y check self report eh, sería I check self report. Mm -hmm. Sí, va. Hombre, el los reportes de venta. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ay, yo también hago eso. <risa> In different companies. Uh -huh. Yes. No way. Hasta yes. los hasta los, los roles de las empresas son súper diferentes. Uh -huh. Depende porque, mucho de las políticas de cada empresa. Sí, porque ella trabaja en una llantería y yo trabajo en la venta de pollo. True, true, true. Mimis, eso estábamos hablando que yo no sé nada de carros. Nada. <risa> nada. Yo, no sabía, yo no sabía, o sea, yo solo sabía que al carro se le echaba agua porque si no el radiador va. Hasta ahí, <risa> la gasolina. <risa> Revisar agua, aceite. Pero ahí aprendí a cómo cambiar una llanta de repuesto. Really? Ahí sí aprendí lo que son muñones, dirección frenos, wow. frenos vacía eh, que si sí tiene tijera he aprendido de que <ríe> todo eso créanme lo que he aprendido y de hecho cuando o sea que no solo está en el, en el área administrativa no, mis, yo, o sea, sí es administrativo lo mío porque soy como que el área de, de redes. Pero es que tú eres mm. como asesor, asesora de ventas. Ah, sí. tiene que saber de todo eso. Ajá. Entonces, ajá, por el rubro del negocio. Ajá, y un día de eso, y o sea, hay personas que vienen desde de Guatemala, Costa Rica, para acá a comprar llantas, porque uh -huh. en otros países no hay de los que venden ahí. Y las medidas y la marca que nos, mm. ellos distribuyen no, no la tienen en Centroamérica, solamente ellos. ¡Wow! Ajá, entonces a mí lo que me llega a ir y a donde yo quiero ir, ahí sí quisiera ir, es al jabalí. <risa> carro, es chivo. Ay, yo pensé pero, que a correr. <risa> pero, este, pero sí le digo yo a Fernando que es bien complicado porque... En Yuar, sí, en el puerto. ¿Cómo? Tu negocio está en el puerto. No, es en Santa Elena. Bueno, hay oh, varias sucursales. Pero la que usted está en Santa Elena. Sí, donde yo estoy, está mm. enfrente a la embajada. Sí, porque yo vi una que está en Constitución. Mira, no, traba, no trabaja alguien ahí que se llama Elmer Trampa. ¿Elmer? Elmer Trampa. Sí. <risa> ya lo conozco. Don Elmer, de hecho, él está en Constitución. 
Really? Ajá, que yo vi el de Constitución. Yo dije, yeah, yeah, the worst there. Pero no sabía en cuál sucursal. Yo pensé que estaba en la sucursal de la libertad. No, 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 yo soy en la de Santa Elena. Es que es ahí en, en Santa Elena. Miss, ya sabe, ya sabe quién le va a conseguir las llantas, gente. <risa> Su mamá <risa> tuve que comprar. <risa> de hecho, para vacación tuve que comprar porque es que andaba una que se ve. Sí, sí, sí porque no lo cotizó con nosotros. No, no. Es que no sé, oh, yo pensé que estaba bien lejos. Y yo dije, ay, no, y ahorita me urge tenía que irme fuera de San Salvador. Así que I got them somewhere else. <risa> Sí, no, sí, varias gente compró. Y este, pero nosotros, eso es lo que pasa, que nosotros a los, a los camioneros, a todos ellos, con, yo siento que los camiones para mí es más fácil. Really? Sí, es más fácil, sumamente más fácil. Una sola medida de llanta, y ahí estuvo. va. Y ya estuvo. <risa> Dos o tres medidas más, y ahí va. Y, y un alineado, un balanceo, y ya estuvo. Se fue. Ya no. <ríe> uh, el cambio, los carros, los uh -huh. pickups, cómo se van, todas esas cosas ya traen sus más complicaciones. Uh -huh. Pero Tiene que ser bien, bien específico. Uh -huh. sí. Así que eso sí me cuesta. Ay, no. Ni modo. <laughs> Sorry. And you finished the activity. Ya casi, Miss. Oh, Solo estamos okay. haciendo las, 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 la última. All right. Mm -hmm. No vamos a tener otro. Sí, a veces yeah. es así. El niño se sale y yo, no, 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 no. <laughs> no se puede, le <laughs> Ya nos van a regañar porque no estamos hablando en inglés, pero bueno. Practice. Ya lo van a tener que leer en la, en la sesión general. Ya, 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 ya. All right, you finished already. Una, una consulta. Yo soy ahorita en el celular. Give me pero... a... Permítame, solo voy a, voy a, a meter mi perrito que ya está de loco. Es que Firulay está loco, pero bueno. Ay, y busqué el nombre de, de los minions. Kyle se llama. Kyle. ¿De los minions? Del perrito. Sí. Lo busqué. El consentido. Sí. Es que me quiero pasar a la, a la, a la compu, pero no sé si se va a cortar. Eh, que termine la sala esta y luego lo hace. Ajá, sí, porque no. no. También. Uh -huh. Sí. Eso era, es que ese ya casi no tiene mucha batería tampoco. No, yo casi mi cel lo traigo descargado todo el tiempo. Es que a mí, me, yo tengo que hacer muchas llamadas, que me llaman, me escriben a cada rato, mi, mi, mi chat está topado. Sí, Hay así, me, así me pasa. Listo, a quien le contesto y les contesto con otro nombre y, y suele a pasar. Los, yo a los, a los médicos, bueno, los tengo... Con el nombre, ¿verdad? Pero si fuesen los pacientes de, de los médicos que me llaman, sí tengo que ponerles el nombre porque son tanta gente que a veces llama y es como, no, imposible. Y para buscarlos más rápido, si en el dado caso tenemos ofertas, pues se les busca mucho más rápido para ofrecerles. Sí. Y, y, pues sí que compren más. Sorry, Marcela, about your question. What was your Dicho, question? Es que eh, me quiero pasar a la computadora, pero no sé si me, si me salgo del, de aquí me va a cerrar muy, muy rápido la sesión, no, no sé. ¿Abre primero la compu? Eh, ya la tengo. Ah, vaya, entonces no se preocupe, igual ya vamos a ir a la sesión general. Ah. Ajá, okay. ahí, la, ahí la vemos. Bye. Ok. <risa> ah, pues, adiós. Me pasa no, la bye. otra. <risa> ok. Thank you. Sí. Ya, le damos la última parte. Me la teacher por aquí. Ya lo grabó, <ríe> ahora que me graba a mí. Dele, ya lo grabé.
Hi. Ajá, are you ready? Algo con sueño lo veo ya, igual que yo. <laughs> Sleeping. Ok. Ya está haciendo estación en el sillón. <laughs> ya deformándose así. <laughs> All right. Bye. Tuvieron tiempo para practicar, así que no excuses, ¿verdad? No va a pasar la lista antes de... It's true. Para aquellos que se incorporaron hasta después, déjenme ver dónde está esta casa de atender. Alice ya no se logró unir. Marcela. Present. Hi. Andrea. Present. Blanca. Present. Diana. Present. Edgar. Present. Edith. Present. Fernando. Present. Miss. Fernando, por eso me está recordando. Thank you, Fer. Gabriela. Gaby, no la veo. Glenda, Margarita. Present. Hans Benjamin. Present, Miss. Isaac. José Daniel. Jocelyn. Juan Miguel. Present. Manuel Alberto. Present. Azca René. Present. Raúl Enrique. Present. Rodrigo Enrique. Present. En Sandra. Present. All right. Vamos a empezar con Sandra. Usted es la suertuda, Sandra. <ríe> Tan alegre que venía. <ríe> Sí. No, si se puede. Está dele. triste que me voy. Go, go, go. No, no me lo esperaba. No, ¿por qué no? Yo solo quería hacer la última. Ah. Sí, los los últimos serán, serán los, los primeros. primeros. Exactly. Vaya, dele. Cuéntenos. Bueno. Eh, no sé a qué nombre digo, cualquiera. ¿A quién puso? Bueno. Hello, Isaac. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. Um, I check the daily sales of the branches. I send remises. I come record. It is a nice job. I am looking for forward to hearing from you. Best regards, Sandra. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Good job. Vaya, ahora usted tiene el privilege de seleccionar el siguiente. Fernando. All right. Yo que le he hecho, le voy a decir. No, qué pecado. Man. You are popular, Fer. Go ahead. Yes. Ok. Ahí le voy. Hello, Diana. I hope you are fine. I want to tell you that I am working a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check emails in my computer. I invoice the cell. I check self report. It's a nice job. I am looking forward to hearing from you. And the end. Bien. <laughs> Bien. <laughs> okay, nice. Best regards, Fernando. All right, Fer, who's next? Uh, Rene. 
All right. <laughs> Hello, Rodrigo. I hope you are excellent. Want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Sometimes mm -hmm. I do are the following. Always checks and emails in my office. Uh, organizes the meeting. Ahí está. Me voy a borrar. <laughs> the meeting, the meeting a conference twice a month and i go to the government uh, office i sometimes train you employ it i check the real, real mat materials and i knew new go new got out of my office it is a new nice job i am looking forward to heading for you okay nice excellent Someone else? And Jocelyn. Jocelyn. Where is Jocelyn? Mm. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Raul. I hope I hope you are blessed. I want to tell you that I am working in a company that recently sold. Some activities I do are analyze profits and loss every month, manage the budget of the company, manage the cash flow, and explain all the movements of the money every week. It is a stressful job. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Nice. Excellent. Who's next? Mm, Raúl. All right. Mm -hmm. Raúl, it's your opportunity. <laughs> You ready, Raúl? Oh, it's me. Yes, it's you. <laughs> <laughs> it's me you're looking for. Yes. <laughs> it's okay. you. Okay. Hello, everyone. Who can I I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I work in, in a good company. Some activities I do, I am go to the count the money. I am well leaving the company. I go to the bank. I am help the account to Okay. Nice. Is that all? Yes, yes. All right, perfect. Yes, yes. Who's next? Choose somebody else. Uh huh. Andrea. Andrea. Okay. Eh, hello, Manuel and Margarita. <laughs> I hope you have a nice day. I want to share you I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I visit doctors to talk about nutritional products. I drive all day from different places. I write reports about all the activities. I like my new job. It's nice. A pleasure to greet, kind regards. All right, good. What's next, Andrea? Manuel. All right. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Ya me lo esperaba. Es que... <risa> la verdad que sí. <risa> Hello, Andrea. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a financial company dedicated to saving and credit. Some activities I do are the following. In the morning, check the emails and respond. Next, I check some credit application, then supervise the teamwork and coordinate. And the end of the month, month I do financial support. It's a nice job, but tiring. I am looking. I am looking forward to hearing. Hearing from you. From you. All right. Good job. All right. Se entendí que que da créditos. If you need money, uh, <laughs> call Manuel. <laughs> All right. If you need any credit to buy a house or a car. <laughs> yes. All right, Manuel. Who's next? Uh, Margarita. All right, Margarita. Okay. Vamos. Hello, Andrea y Manuel. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I working in a news company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check emails in my phone. I organize com capacitation one a month. I am looking for work to hear from you. Nice. All right, thank you. <laughs> I organize, organize training. Yeah, it sounds better if you say organize training, right? Okay, nice. And who's next, Margarita? Miguel. Isaac. Miguel. There is Miguel here. Creo que no está. Oh yes, he's here, but he's not listening or practicing. Que le llegue a Isaac. No Diana. <laughs> so Diana. Ay. <laughs> Interpretation de las caras de Diana. <laughs> Go ahead. Hello, Fernando. I hope you are excellent. I want to turn your that I work in Doño. Some I some activities I do are check my emails, my cell phones, my and customer service. I sometimes treat a new of my office in my computer. It's a very nice job. I like it. <laughs> Miss. Bien convencida se vio al final. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Lugar de trabajo se dice workplace. Workplace. Uh -huh. yes. Ah, workplace. vaya, vaya Diana. <laughs> workplace to work. It's a It's a very looking. It's a beautiful workplace, you can say. It's an interesting, it's a relaxing workplace. It's a very great place <laughs> to work. <laughs> Ok, cuánta sinceridad acá. <laughs> Too much. All right, who's next, Diana? Um, Edith. Edith. <laughs> <laughs> Practicing <laughs> esta <laughs> vez. Hi, Miss. Hi. Um, I. I hope you are excellent. I want to say you that I am working in the food company. 
uh, some activities I do are the following. Mm, I always chat email in my office. I pre prepare it from payment report. I do college mm, management. I document document I document documentation review in office. I do dwelling billing. No sé cómo se pronuncia billing. Ajá, billing. Uh, yes. That's all. <laughs> a lot of activities, Edith. Repeat, repeat, eh, uh, repetición de, eh, llamadas a clientes. No sé cómo se pronuncia. I make phone calls or I call customers. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. All right. Thank you, Edith. Who hasn't participated? Levante la mano los que no han participado. <laughs> All right. Marcela, go. Una sonrisita antes, dice. El micro. El, el, micro. el micrófono, Marcela. I'm sorry. Uh, hello, Jocelyn and Hans. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check emails very times a day in my cell. I organize conference with a doctors and nurses. I do visit doctors in a hospital in a private clinics. And I never stay in an office. It's a nice job because it allows me to meet more people. I'm Great. looking forward to hear you from you. Nice. Good job. All right. Edgar. Hello, Isaac and Sandra. I hope are you excellent. I want to tell you that I work in the security company. Uh, some activities I do are the following are way check in my MS, in my computer, pass a report and pass as as assistant at uh, I check in the and the real material, material, take a video video camera. Mm -hmm. uh, take a video camera. Uh, it is a nice job. Uh, I am looking forward to hearing hearing from for you. To hearing from you. Nice. Good job. Okay. Who else? Who has not participated? Isaac has not True. Isaac, lo delataron. Ahí está Gaby también. Uh -huh. Can I start? Yes, please. Hello, everyone. I hope all of you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check my office. I evaluate product in the plant. I sometimes train new employees and I check the raw materials. And I usually go to the plant to evaluate the process or evaluate the product. And air pollution aside, it's a nice job. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Kind of parts. Nice. Good job. All right. Who else? Que más no participado? Ayúdenme. Blanca. Yes, Blanca. Your turn. Yes. 
through. Mm -hmm. Tell us. Hello, um, a todos, ¿cómo se dice? Everybody. <laughs> Hi. Hello, Hi, everybody. everybody. Uh -huh. I hope, uh, I hope everybody, uh, it's, it's fine. I want to tell you that uh -huh. I'm working in a company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check in my, my computer, mm -hmm. uh, emails in my office. I organize financial report, you say accounting in the ERP system. I signal financial statements. Thank you. All right, nice job. Excellent. Uh huh. Somebody else? No es por nada, mi, pero creo que no he escuchado a Rodrigo y a Miguel. <laughs> Verdad que Fernando bien se convierte en el teacher's assistant. <laughs> Yo no sé quiénes no han participado, pero si no, solo a mí me van a culpar, así que nice, thank you. Ay, <ríe> <en> el grupo? <ríe> ya ya me voy a caer. <ríe> pero don't worry, no es en persona, así que they never know, they never know who you are. <ríe> okay, my turn. All right. Hello, Rene. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check um, emails in my office. I organize conference twice a month. I something I train new employees. I check the raw materials. I never go out to my office. It's a nice job. I am looking forward to hearing from you. King's regard. Thanks, regards, Rodrigo. All right, good job. All right. Okay. Well, uh, Gaby and Miguel, creo que solo los tenemos en, moda, en modalidad o en formato de listeners, porque no, no creo que estén uh, participating. No sé, quizás están driving or están en un meeting or something. <laughs> okay. But they are not participating. I'm sorry. Okay, from the rest, oh yeah, participant, everybody. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Bueno, vamos a hacer un review. Vamos a dar contenido que. Teacher. De, yes. Tenía tell me. Una una pregunta nada dígame, más. Dígame. Eh, las inscripciones para el, el segundo módulo. Ya hoy que te, finalizábamos la las primeras dos semanas o iniciamos las primeras dos semanas uh -huh. ese nos van a enviar algún correo o nosotros tenemos que enviarlo a estos chicos a Rodrigo de hecho déjenme yo creo que ellos lo contactan uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Sí. pero si sí, lo siento por interrumpir no worries, okay. Pero, eh, si ellos nos contactan, o sea, ellos nos contactan a nosotros, ¿verdad, Miss? Entonces, eh, sería como que no perderíamos la continuidad o tendríamos como una pausa. Sí, hay una pausa generalmente. Hay, no es como que ese día se finalice, el siguiente día se, se inicia. El, sí, siempre tienen que esperar como, es como una semana, creo, para ir al nivel 2. Como un break. Uh -huh. Oh, ya yeah. conoceríamos nuevos compañeros. Okay. Sometimes there are new partners. <laughs> Uy, so sad. But... Ay, no. <laughs> Pero igual, estén pendientes porque si no, usted, igual ustedes le pueden escribir a los técnicos. Ahí en el grupo de WhatsApp igual les pueden contactar para ver si tienen que hacer alguna gestión o mandar algún documento. Sí, porque me imagino que ellos revisan la asistencia, si uno llenó las 
los formularios los porque requisitos. no le van a llamar no le van a llamar si uno no ha hecho nada de la tarea ni tampoco ha tenido la asistencia que ellos requieren me imagino por eso no Exacto. creo que ellos los contacten a todos sí sobre todo cuando, cuando yo no sea no está temblando en su está casa temblando. Eh, no. Sí, está temblando. Pues, se me dice, no me doy cuenta. Sí, está temblando. Se me cae el rancho, se me cae el rancho. <risa> el tele. Hey, el está tele. temblando, se cayó la cacerola ahí. <risa> sí, 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 pero creo que se sintió antes donde Diana. Aquí fue se fuerte. Sintió, pero aquí. Puchita, aquí fue bien fuerte. ¿Really? Sí. Sí, aquí se sintió, pero sí justo al ratito que usted empezó a decir. Oh es como God. que tenía la bueno, últimamente sucede de todo pero bueno yo sé la pena qué pasó Eri que es que la pepa te asusta la pepa de Jocelyn entonces <ríe> la pepa es her pet Cuis Pepa. I believe it's her pet. Uh -huh. All yes. right. Bueno, no. everybody fine? Yes? Okay. Yes. yes. Thank God. All right. Como les decía, sí, igual, este, hay, que, hay que cumplir los requisitos, pero sí creo que es hasta que se finaliza el módulo. Ya, para las inscripciones. Ok, para ver todo el... el como el summary de las notas también, ¿verdad? De la plataforma y de los, y de los exámenes. De hecho, justo al terminar esta, esta unidad también hay un midterm. Es el examen de medio término. Right? So, vayan revisando. Uh, espero que ya hayan llegado hasta ahí, of course. Si no, tomorrow me van a aparecer ahí los números. Si <ríe> no, hoy les va a tocar desvelarse. Aparte de, ok, so you need to, esto es lo que comprendía la unidad 2, que okay, iniciábamos con vocabulary, ok, hablando de los diferentes uh, puestos de trabajo, obviamente, de los diferentes roles, de las diferentes actividades que les, que les puede corresponder hacer dependiendo de la posición, ¿verdad? De la job position que tengan, así pueden ser las tasks o las actividades que les corresponde hacer. Eh, luego entrábamos con un poco más de lleno a la parte de la estructura, que era eh, crear affirmative y negative statements, no solamente con las primeras personas, ¿verdad? Que son las que por lo general no dan problema en el verbo. I, you, we, they. Eh, luego también se enfatizaba en el uso de la third person singular, hablábamos obviamente de los días de la semana, de conocer el vocabulary, ¿verdad? Si estamos hablando de daily routines, que conocer los días, las frecuencias con las que se hacen las, las actividades. Y luego enfatizaba el uso de eh, es, okay, el cambio que surge en la tercera persona, ¿verdad? Para he, she, it, que se le agrega la es, o he, es, o I, he, es, dependiendo del spelling del verbo. Y el auxiliar para el negativo que dejaría de ser don't y sería doesn't, para he, she, it. ¿Ok? Luego resolvíamos eso. Hemos estado hablando, obviamente, de daily routines, de forma afirmativa, de forma negativa. Y pues también llegamos a la parte de hacer questions, yes, no questions, right? Que obviamente también sí, casi el mismo patrón, solamente que ya no es en negativo, ya deja de ser don't y pasa a ser do nada más, deja de ser doesn't y pasa a ser does, que es el auxiliar con el que se inicia la yes, no question. Para I, you, we, they, sería iniciar con do y las respuestas cortas, ¿verdad? I'm sorry, give me one second. Uy, sí se sintió algo fuerte. Sí, bastante. Entonces, ¿quiere decir que ya terminamos? No. no. <risa> ya me quería ir a vivir. 
sí. La unidad dos terminamos. Sleeping. Huh? <risa> 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 ok. So, estamos haciendo un repaso de los temas que hemos visto a través de la unidad 2 porque tienen que completar el examen de midterm. Aparte de haber terminado la unidad 2 también, ¿verdad? I am finished. You finished everything? Yes. All right, perfect. Okay, that's great. Bueno, luego completábamos eso que era ya de preguntar, ¿verdad? Hacer las questions. The yes, no question de responder de forma affirmative o de forma negative, pero siempre usando el auxiliary. Eh, un truco que creo que les va a servir si lo recuerdan, obviamente, en todos los tiempos en inglés, para hacer yes, no question en cualquier tiempo gramatical, se inicia con un auxiliary y con ese mismo auxiliary que se ha hecho la question, se hace la short answer. Yes? ¿Se fijan acá? ¿Do I get up early? Yes, I do. No, I don't. No puedo decir, do I get up early? Y decir, yes, I does. No tiene sentido. Yes? Entonces, es con el mismo auxiliary que se ha formulado la question. Eso cuando usted, alguien le pregunta algo, fíjese con qué auxiliar inició. Obviamente, si la pregunta está bien formulada, pues con ese mismo auxiliar va a responder. Yes? So, eso es algo que debemos mantener en cuenta. Luego, había esta parte que, que debíamos completar, ¿verdad? Pero, pues, no tenemos como muchas diferentes, uh, o oh, más bien dicho, diferentes job positions, que era la, perdón, era esta parte. Justo después de esta explicación, acá estaban las, las occupations que ya nos daban, que teníamos que completar con los names y las activities que esas personas realizan. Debido a estas occupations que tienen, obviamente, right? Entonces, acá igual tenemos que escribir nuestra daily routine y la routine de algún partner. Obviamente, para hacer esto nos va a llevar un poquito de tiempo. Así que la de ustedes ya no la escriban, solo la de algún partner. Por ejemplo, si nos vamos otra vez a los grupos de trabajo, solo díganle, ajá, decime qué es lo que se es. Tell me about your daily routine y escríbanlo. Por ejemplo, si... Estoy con un compañero hombre, entonces digo, he checks emails every day, he arranges meetings, he uh, calls customers. Ya, yeah, por ejemplo, cinco, max, cinco actividades de las que su partner realiza. Si usted le prestó atención cuando su partner le estuvo leyendo el email, ya la recuerda. Y ya no tiene que volver a prestarle atención por decir algo, ¿verdad? Ya las tiene como, ah, ya recuerdo que fue lo que me dijo que él o ella hacía. Sí. Y las escribe en esta parte, ¿ok? Por eso vamos a tener 5 minutes para que la realice, ¿ok? Veamos. Obviamente si no tienen el mando lo pueden hacer en su cuaderno. It's fine, no problem, ¿ok? Excelente. Ah, sería como she, she visiting to the doctors. Ah, es que me perdí como 20 minutos ahorita. Este, no sé, no sé por qué en realidad se me cayó el internet acá. Reinicié el modo. I take a photograph, a photography. Ok. I, 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 I only. 
Okay. okay. Three activities. Very good. He accompanied the company. I work with the company. I go uh, to the back. He... Quiero ver. He... ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo? La revisión de la planificación sería... Re check. Eh, check. 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 Raw materials, perdón. Ah, sí, esa la puse. <ríe> ah, ya puede quedar como... Que me acordé. He verifies raw materials. Ma ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Materials. 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 Ah. Sería, o sea, en español, ¿cómo sería? Miss... ¿Cómo sería si yo atiendo a los clientes? I attend customers. I attend customers. Pero, ¿y Fernando cómo lo tendría que decir? She attends customers. Mm. Uh -huh. Miss, ¿por qué cuando lo traduzco en el traductor, valga la redundancia, uh -huh. dice she serves? Puede ser, serves. Aunque generalmente serves es más como si usted atiende clientes por en un, en un restaurante, por ejemplo, servir algo. ¿Y en el otro? Attend, como atender. ¿Como flight attendant? She attend sería a... A-T-T-E-N-D-S, attend. Attendance. Uh -huh. She attends customers. Entonces, entonces quedaría como que she attends a customer. Sin el A, solo customers, en plural, porque son varios. She attends cons customers. Or clients. Uh -huh. Y entonces, she, he. ¿Y él cómo sería eh, de que revisa las, eh, como que... Eh, Saca facturas y todo eso. He, he gets, checks, yes. creates, no sé cuál verbo uso. Get. Sería como que él factura las ventas. Invoices. Uh -huh. He, he invoices. Sales. Get. He invoices sales. Uh -huh. He invoices sales. Entonces sería he invoice sales. Okay. He check the emails. Recibe llamada. Sí. ¿Cómo quedaría entonces en ese caso? Sería he, she, she mm -hmm. answer calls. She answer calls. She receives calls. She receives answers. Mays, phone calls. <laughs> Cualquiera de los verbos que se quiera usar. Hacen solo recibir. She receives calls. Uh -huh. Recibe, contesta, hace llamadas. Llama este de la de los envoys y de ahí quiero ver qué más de los que de los que se dan como que uh, que hacía como lo que hacen man, anualmente o mensualmente no dijo que hacía como 
Ay, no me acuerdo. Fer, repítaselo. Ajá. ¿Qué era lo que decía mensualmente? Ajá, que, que, que van a hacer como... Inventarios. Inventario, eso. Y ahí la tiene sufriendo, Fer, y se la puede repetir. ¿Cómo se dice, ¿Cómo se dice eso? Y me dice inventories, create inventories. Y... Maze Inventory uh -huh. Every month Y Diana hace inventario ¿Mm? Hace inventario No Qué triste Es bien <risa> divertido <risa> She fixes cars <risa> She replaces tires. She makes sales. No, 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 no. Eso no lo, no lo. Ahí estuviera con, todavía en el inventario del mes pasado. Ah, ¿qué más haces tú? Ready. All right. Andrea, tell me about your partner. One. <laughs> Just about one partner, yes. Okay. Uh, Margarita says she visits doctors. Mm -hmm. She sends emails. Mm -hmm. She delivers nutritional products. She visits pharmacies and she checks planification. Nice, planning. That's great. Let's see, let's continue with Rene. Tell me about your partner. It's Rodrigo, okay. right? My, my partner is Rodrigo. All right. Uh, uh, the activities yes, for him. Uh -huh. Yes, he does. Uh, he read a newspaper. Very good. He sociality. <laughs> he sociality media. Uh, he managed he, social media. He managed social, social media. Uh -huh. He manages social media. He takes a photo. Very good. That's a new, very, very job. Great influencer, que Rodrigo. Yeah? Yes, yes. <laughs> Luisito Comunica. <laughs> <laughs> Traveling for fun, but yes, he goes to restaurants, take photos, post on the social media. I know, todos envidiamos a That's it. Yes, only that. Nice. Okay, Isaac, tell me about your partner. I think, Isaac, your microphone is off. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Right. Um, my partner was uh, Sandra. Uh -huh. She sent remittances. 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 And she does uh, accounting records. That's all. And, uh, yes, because we were three. But uh -huh. um, uh, we could. We uh, couldn't finish the, the you couldn't exercise. you couldn't finish it, right? It's because I only can only uh, myself and Sandra. Mm. Uh, Edgar uh, uh, was with us, but he couldn't uh, right. talk about himself. His activities, yes, because yeah, probably because you were three, it was impossible to finish. All right, no worries. No worries. Last attendance. Los que no han participado tomorrow will participate, okay? So don't worry. <laughs> Porque ya se están durmiendo. Solo digan present, please. Marcela. Present. Andrea. Present. Blanca. Diana. Present. Edgar. No sé si Edgar se retiró. Present. Ah, Edith, <ríe> Fernando, Present. Gabriela, Present. Glenda Margarita, Present. Anne, Isaac, 
No, no. Jocelyn. Present. Manuel. Present. René. Present. Raúl. Rodrigo. Present. Sandra. Present. Ok, veamos. ¿A quién le correspondería a Hans participar en los 10 minutes? One on one. Hans, are you ready? See you tomorrow. See you. Where is Hans? Se fue Hans. Bye. Bye. Creo que se le Goodbye, cayó el internet. Es nuevo. cierto, le estaba fallando. I'm sorry. Next. Ok, who's next? Déjenme ver si todavía está acá el next one. Next, Isaac. Ok, Isaac. Let's I see go. goodbye. Ah, he's still here. Ok. So, Isaac, would you stay? All right, good. Thank you. Bye. Bye. The rest. Go and rest. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Enjoy. Have a good night. And we still have some people around here. Let me just put them in the waiting room. Isaac, tell me about yourself. Tell me how your day was today. I have a pretty busy day. Mm -hmm. um, I have to go uh, to a meeting in the morning. I had to check on a lot of uh, emails. I had to elaborate a lot of reports. And it was a busy day. Is it normal for, I mean, for a Monday to be that busy? Kind of, kind of, because Monday we, 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 Monday we usually uh, have a lot of meetings in the morning. But the day was an special one because we, uh, we had to elaborate or prepare because we uh, we were uh, testing um, like uh, uh, our product versus uh, uh, the rivals the, the product really because we we uh, we made uh, red fried beans for pupusas. oh nice so, so that a, is that is a product that you're going to put into the market soon no, uh, the product is already in the market, but um, the marketing and sales area, where they are reading about a possible operating product, or if the, if the product is good enough for another market, mm -hmm. uh, target market. So uh, we had this test uh, and was, uh, because of that was a, a pretty busy day. That's challenging, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, because uh, we had to travel to the center of capital to reach for some specific products of the of the company, right? and we had to come. You were searching the, for the competitors. Yes, because. <laughs> and who because, elaborates the pupusas in your company? Ah, uh, a, a, a co-worker uh, uh, helped us to elaborate the pupusas because me and me and my uh, partner in the, uh, in the in the department uh, we didn't know how to make pupusas. <laughs> <laughs> we have no abilities to to, to make pupusas. I know. Imagine. Yeah, sometimes there are some unexpected activities that that you never thought you were gonna do at your work, right? I think that I can I can make tortillas. I think but it's, it's, yeah, it's a bit more difficult. And for some people, I mean, if they are in the business of making pupusas, it's easier than making tortillas. But I mean, to each his own, right? To anyone who is yes. in the in the yeah in the area. How challenging that is, yes. But thank God, 
yeah, thank God you had a partner who's able to, to do a lot of those things. Yes, most part of, the, of last year, uh, it was only me in the, in the department. So try to cover all the uh, all the aspects of the plant because there is a, a like a nutrition, nutrition level work. Mm -hmm. There is like a, a an, an export a, a tramites that we need to to well, Task, yes, for just one person. Yes, and, your, now, and your and your specialization area is in food engineering. Wow, that's an interesting career. Uh, about two years, well, three years ago, we did a research about the universities that provide this career because my students were interested in different careers, so. We went to the the campus that Universidad de Salvador has in Talpa, and we investigated about uh, this engineering in agronomy. I think I, I'm not quite sure now because they they I mean showed us that very very simple process on how to make cheese on how to process cheese, and then they say this is a huge thing you know that we go through for five years so. They showed us like the smallest process, the simplest process. And then we went to another university, I guess, Matia Delgado, that they also have this career. So it's a very interesting area. Also, the University of Sesame Antonia also has this. Oh, experience. they do? Yes, so, they started three years ago or four years ago, mm, I guess. That's why, yeah. At that time, we were able just to visit those two. And then we had a presentation about what the career is about, the requirements and the challenges. Yeah, but it's really interesting. We do have people that study that career too. It's a lot of, of chemistry subjects in the, in the career, also a lot of, of math subjects. I believe, because it's an engineering, right? Yes. Yeah, you have to calculate like every, everything for every single process, temperature, quantities, pressure, measurements, right. Yes, we, we have like a, a, a specific subject that is for, for fluid trans, uh, trans, transfers, for heat transfers, and for mass transfers. Imagine. Because uh, there is like a uh, a lot of processes that are only uh, involved for heat transfer, others for fluid transfer, in order for mass transfer. So they are very challenging now subjects. I believe, <laughs> but you like it. <laughs> How many years I, have you been working in that area? Uh, I've been working in this area since 2017, I guess. Quite a few years. Mm -hmm. Example, uh, the Matias Club has like a, a like a, another focus because they are they are they are they, they are more focused on on like a, a elaborate new products or more focus like a, in the in the agronomy section in like in fruit. Or yes, or they, they, they actually the day that we went, they had a fair where they had created this new product, a new way of preserving this innovative product. That that's how they presented it that day. Like that in the in the law in the law section of the of the career because there is like a two or three subjects only for laws like uh, good laws in El Salvador uh, Central America uh, good laws the uh, FDA uh, European regulations and it's also like a more focus on that and uh, like uh, in 
industrial process, like a uh, beer process, a cheese process, a, like a more um, industrial process. Mm -hmm. Matthias True. has another, another focus. But yeah, another focus. Yeah, I, I, I bet every institution has a way of approaching each career, right? Mm -hmm. And you That's graduated the... from US. Yes, yes. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Yeah. I, I, I All right. What about the classes? Do you have any question or anything you would like to know? No, oh, I think that everything is clear. All right. Great. Nice. Nice of you staying because I guess Hans had some issues with his internet. I guess it's because of the rain. I heard that in some places it's raining. It's horrible. <laughs> it's horrible. When we start in my here in my, in my area, it's not working very well since, since last week. Monday, Monday, or, uh -huh. or, or, or it was Tuesday where the, the huge storm hit. Oh, and the and the uh, and the home internet that is clear, uh, it's not working very well. For example, uh, that was the yesterday Sunday we uh, uh, we it rained uh, a lot again. We have internet all day. In the house. All day. Oh my god. And where do you live? Uh, I live in Costa Cancino. Oh, really? So we are so, nearby because I'm here in Mexicano. Oh, Mexicanos. <laughs> Mexicanos. Uh, I, cross, I travel across Mexicanos. And, I saw and these days, of, because of the holidays, the traffic? Yes, well, it was horrible. <laughs> but horrible. One of what? the day, I, I take like a one hour to arrive to my, to, to my work. Because the day after the storm, I spent like four hours just going around i couldn't Everything get was close everywhere i went it was I, horrendous I, I got out of my house at, at seven 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 ten i guess seven 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 and i arrived at work almost at night because i was bouncing from and you're supposed to be at work at eight <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Well, thank you so very much for staying and having a conversation. And thank you for your participation in class as well. Okay. Have a good night. Go rest <laughs> after making pupusas at work. <laughs> okay, good night. All right.